G'day. Today, hang on. Oh, what's this? It looks like we have a toolbox. No, it's Ulta Beauty Beauty Box Caboodles Edition. It's a 39 piece collection. It's a $171 value. The price tag here says $29.99, but picked it up at $19.99 plus tax. Let's see what we have in the tag here. It's kind of hard to see, being gold and white. The collection includes an eyeshadow, face palette, brow trio, two lip balms, lip gloss, oils, face primer, shadow primer, liquid blush, lip liner, brow pencil, blush, brush, and a whole bunch of brushes. Inside, uh, this is even more difficult to read because it is fine print with gloss, gold background, and white text. I ah, forget that. But let's see. You see a nice caboodle logo with the Ulta Beauty. Made of polypropylene in China. Seems like a decent sized box. Let's see how big this box is. It's about 12 inches wide, 7 inches deep, and 6 inches high. It's a pretty decent handle. The leather, clear and glitter. All right. Let's see what's inside. Let's, okay, this is a flip and flip thing. Actually, there we go. Ah, it's like a toolbox. We have this top section and this bottom section. Yeah, let's see what's inside the top layer. Hey, we have a, a mirror. That's a bit bright. You see there? Let's see what's actually inside this. In this removal tray, we have no gloss. Let's try this out. You see his lip oil. Two bottles of lip oil on the top one. This one's peach. This one is this one's strawberry. And for the lip gloss, we have peony. And we have rose color. That's what it looks like. Top tray. In the bottom of that, uh, we have some brushes. One for the brow, eyeshadow, and blush. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see here. This blush brush is a good five inches long. Seems like a decent size. I don't know how to put it back. Oh, here we have liquid blush, peach shimmer. Put that back. In the bottom. Hey, they got some silica gels just to keep the moisture away. On the side here, Looks like we have a simple way to get out. Eyebrow pencils. This one's for dark brown. Peony. Oh, okay, this looks like, oh, these are dual lips. These are dual eye. So you have two colors on this one. You have black and you have dark brown on this side. Oh, neat. 
and this is just they end up in the middle there, which are usable. And we get to the bottom tray. It's a bit difficult. So in this bottom part, it looks like we have a whole bunch of... This one has 18 shades, so it's the eyeshadow palette. See here? Some of them look a little bit shimmery. A few matte ones in the mix. Oh, let's see. Shimmer, sage, navy. Okay, based on the back of here, shimmer blue. This is reverse, so the matte cream. What's on the left here is on the left here. Same bottom right, shimmer pewter, shimmer pewter. So it's not, it's not an X-ray version version of it. Let's see, so this one would be based on tag here. A face palette, two blushes, a bronzer, and a highlighter. What do we have? Matte bronzer, pink blush, coral blush, and gold highlighter. Oh, I think I got some on my finger. This little other thing looks to be. A brow trio. Let's see what can we... Looks like a matte finish. This one, if you can see it, looks dimpled or at least some kind of texture. It doesn't look glittery. This is just medium dark brow wax. I think this is the brow wax. It's so the brow wax, and that we have medium, light medium brow powder, medium dark brow powder, which is confusing now because we have brown brown and the wax, brow brow. We have the powder powder and the wax, so I don't understand how they are working to label these because this is when you flip it across, it's the reverse, but this is the you're looking straight on. That's confusing. So we also have here, we have face primer. And what is this? Eyeshadow primer. And two lip balms. This is, this is color. We have apple scented lip balm and mango scented lip balm. That really comes out. That really comes out as a lemon. That really comes out as mango. Let me see this one. <laughs> it smells like candy apple. Or at least the apple you get. It's fabricated. Looks like there are no dividers at the bottom here. And when you pull things out from the blister shell and you toss them in the bottom, it's going to be a bit crazy. Nothing really sits where they should be. Let's make sure I got 39 as promised. So there's we've got one, two, three. Four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen individual pieces, but the box on the 
tag says 39, so I'm gonna guess these, and counting individually is one, two, three, four, five, six, and blah, blah, blah. So that's a bit of a stretch of the definition of items. Let's actually get this back in. Of course, once you're actually in the thick of making use of this caboodle, you won't have these blisters to be in your way. But that's pretty handy. It's a little accessory clicks close. So you don't accidentally have things flying out. Actually, let's see how this flows when we take everything out as expected. Let's see the top shelf, we got the lip gloss and the lip oil. While I'm on the top shelf, we have our brushes. Which just roll away. And here we have the liquid wash. And finally, the lip liners. All up, this is all up. This is what it looks like straight out of the box, emptied as expected. So, I believe the plan here is then to mix and match and cultivate your own collection of makeup materials and tools and throw them in the box in this computer. It's more like a suit your own device. As you grow and understand how to apply this. And that's it. See you next time on Supernatural.